everybody, and welcome back to another episode of the Mario Strikers Charged Let's Play. Um, I was going to go to where I failed last time, but you might be able to see it already. I somehow managed to be the top scorer in the group with one game left against Donkey Kong, who's the bomb scorer. And if I don't concede four goals, I'll be the least conceded and get both trophies somehow. This it was a lot of luck that brought me here. But if I can get to the very top. It started off with a very lucky win against Bowser Jr. Uh, I got like four goals off a of Mega Strike, which was super OP, I didn't even believe it. And it was like not fully charged, it was a 6-1 with no no power, it was just a misclick. Then I got a 6-0 on Diddy Kong, pretty lucky, three goals from Mega Strike. I lost to Peach, beat Bowser, really close game. Then I got two goals late, Wario just did not defend right, got two goals off a of Mega Strike, while Luigi got three goals off a of Mega Strike. Really easy to pick apart. Mario barely won. Daisy beat me. She, I was winning, and then she got a mega strike in like the last ten seconds. I was like um, five with red and orange. That that screwed me up. I couldn't save all of them. I saved two, but I conceded three. So yeah, last game of the group. If I can just hold a defensive game and win, I will get top of the group, the um, defensive and offensive award. So unless Donkey Kong scores like 40 goal, uh, 10 goals on me, then I should be fine. Intersection. All right. I might skip on a game or two, or after this game, I might just skip into where I was last time. I just want to show you guys that somehow I actually meant to do it. I don't. I don't know what just happened there. I don't know what happened with the electricity because no one got electrocuted. Oh dang. Drybones has also done a lot of cheesy things for me. Just want to point that out. I think he's contributed to eight of my goals. There was one game he was just like man of the match. He scored three goals. Oh, I forgot my banana was there. That works. Oh, that works really well. Daisy did to me. No. 
However, that was pretty lucky to get to. Admittedly, the heavy hitters didn't get that lucky with the goals, and I got a lot of lucky opportunities to get goals and win. I mean, I had two eight goal games, so that really helped. No chip shot there. Actually, I might be able to. Nah, alright. I was thinking maybe I might be able to get one more shot. Nothing really matters. The top of the table. We were the last game. And we were already on the top. Bam. Okay. I was really close to stopping him as well. But yeah. Anytime we see him getting almost fully charged, it's almost a, like, take a massive one for the team. If I have anyone near him, it's not even a goal to tackle him, it's to tackle him at the right frame, because if he's far enough away, you're not going to tackle him, but if you're just close enough, you can stop him right before he does his um, special ability and screw you. Final eight remain. Luigi cements a place in the final eight. Cements. I'm, I'm top of the table, alright? You don't need to make it sound like I barely made it. Knockout play begin. Can the green machine... Gotta flex on them. Luigi takes place in defensive history. Luigi wins the Brick Wall Award for allowing the fewest goals in round robin play. A defensive first game plan to, to begin the best. I'm so tired right now. It's 12 22 a.m. Look at it. Look at it. I Luigi celebrates big goals with a big trophy. Luigi wins the golden foot for scoring the most goals in round robin play. Well planned teamwork resulted in his team the best. I'm so tired, I can't even like breathe. But yeah, Striker Cup trophy rewards, congratulations on winning both. We get the Elijah Stadium for our domination. Really? I guess you unlock the Galactic Stadium in other ways, because I know I've had that for like ever. But yeah, this is how the stats lined up. Duffy hung and Waluigi didn't make it there. 46 conceded. Wow. But yeah. Schedule. We're reversing the winner of... Ooh, that's a little scary. Both these two gave me trouble when I fought them. I barely beat Mario, but I barely lost to Daisy, so I don't know. Diddy Kong was... Not that much of a struggle. It started off a little challenging, but... I worked around it. Just don't give me... Okay, I was gonna say, like, don't give me the sand tomb. Cause that one's gonna be really f tough to fight Diddy Kong on. Because if he makes my players go away, he can get a huge advantage if he gets, like, fast ones. Uh, I think he had enough time, and it would've really messed up. Ha! Huh. Maybe? Yes! The way Critter was standing was... N yes! J Bone also has a really got it again. But no one's up. Oh Ooh, boy. That was scary stuff. Scary stuff. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna just skip to the game that I lost, or if I'm going to record all these games, I don't know. It just kind of like, I don't know if it's really worth it. I mean, it's only one game though, right? I'd only be skipping this game. I don't know. Well, if it's a good game, I'll keep it. If I win like 8-0, I will So really weird, I just noticed. The way that they seeded that is weird. They put the second place team and the first place team on the same side of the bracket. Ooh, skip it. Ooh, 
Imagine just getting that last little thing to happen. So this is where I lost last round, last time I tried to play. I'll probably just make a little edited montage of all the goals I scored between this game and this game. And on all ones I conceded. Ironically, I lost to Bowser Jr. Now I'm facing Bowser. So, yeah. Is the Bowser family gonna go 2 0 on me? Or am I gonna win? I'm gonna let this game play out like it. It should because this is the game that I lost last time. And if I win, I go into next and most probably intense round I'm gonna have. And well, definitely the most hard one I'm gonna have. For a long time. Oh wow. Okay. I just went for the item there. Didn't have time. Just had that look on her face and her positioning. Ah, oh, I thought I could bait all of them and just get a nice little. Actually, might be able to do something here. Yes, hard greed. I breathe. No! Just didn't get that set up in time. Place right time, main man. He read my tackle there. Oh, the, oh Birdo. That's the worst part about Birdo. She could just spam the uh, tackle because there's like no lag on it and it's faster than her normal move. See if you can just be like, yeah, I want to score. Just got the ball. Passed it once. Scored. No! What? I was holding down the shooting button. I was trying to do a charge. Fudge, I lost again now. seconds. So after this, I would lose another two times, both of them in the semifinals, leading us to where the video is going to continue from now. Unfortunately, 
uh, settings got messed up and my mic volume is super low while the game's volume is super loud, so you can probably barely hear what I'm saying. So I do apologize for that, there's no way of fixing that since I recorded the audio and game together. That's why the audio has also been a little bit ahead, I haven't been able to change that. I will fix that though, next episode, so yeah, I apologize for this.